welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathy for those of you that are new here and my channel is dedicated to cleaning and organizing your home, making sure you have the motivation that you need to get your home in order. In today's video, we're gonna be doing a clean out of this refrigerator right here and I'm going to be showing you how I organize it once I get my curbside order of groceries today. So if you guys like this kind of video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button down below, subscribe if you're new and let's get right on into this video. I do my fridge clean out once a week, usually the morning of or the day before I pick up my groceries for the week. And the first thing that I go ahead and do is just check the expiration dates on everything to make sure I don't have to throw anything out that's gone bad. And then I also check if there's any takeout containers, making sure that those don't stay in for the next week as well. And I would recommend wiping out your drawers every week. This just prevents there from being a lot of buildup and makes your fridge stay as clean as possible throughout the week. And then I have to know, are you a fan of red onions, white onions, or yellow onions? Comment below and let me know which one your favorite is. I personally am a fan of the red onions. And you may notice those three lonely bell peppers up top and the reason that they're out there and not in the drawer is because they're kind of wrinkly and like almost bad. So I want to make sure that I use them either this day or the next day to quickly make something so that I don't put them to waste. that I'm going to share with you real quick is I drink these sparkling waters up top these lime ones and for the longest time I thought they were called La Crocs. My brother told me that they're called LaCroix so just um, a PSA for those of you that don't know they're called LaCroix. And the condiments can most definitely get out of hand, so I like to categorize them and arrange them. I put the stuff that the kids use frequently on the bottom, and then like the hot sauces and stuff more on the top. And another thing that really grosses me out is all like the crusties that gather around the top of the hot sauce. So I like to go ahead and wipe all of that down while I'm cleaning out the refrigerator as well. give you some extra motivation showing you that I really am rinsing everything out that I took out of my refrigerator and also showing you that I do use my dishwasher and a lot of my cleaning videos I wash my dishes by hand but no I use my dishwasher and only wash by hand if my dishwasher is full and I can't fit anything else in there. Okay guys, so I already picked up my curbside order and I've gone to Costco, so I'm just going to kind of give you a quick tour and rundown of how my fridge is organized and how clean it looks. So I definitely, again, recommend cleaning it out once a week before you go grocery shopping. Just get rid of everything that's expired and just wipe everything down because you don't know what's hiding in the back if you don't get down in there.
And Brussels sprouts are one of my favorite vegetables. I have this sriracha honey oven recipe that I absolutely love. So let me know down below, what is one of your favorite veggie recipes? I do still pre-cook a lot of my meals for the week so you'll see my lunches are pre-packed down here and that just makes it so much easier same thing with the kids fruit I pre-cut a lot of it on Sunday so that it's ready for the first half of the week definitely have to cut some more during the week but at least we kind of start out with everything ready to go In the freezer on the top shelf I keep my fish and shrimp as well as the kiddos breakfast they love eggo waffles I have some frozen muffins and kolaches for them just stuff that's quick because we're always in a rush in the morning and then my fruit and veggies down on the bottom If you're wondering what's in those Ziploc bags right there, that's actually overripe bananas that I went ahead and froze for smoothies this week as well. And before we go ahead and finish up this video, I wanted to give you guys a quick update on my pantry and laundry room. So I did a pantry organization video, which I will link down below if you haven't seen it already, but I just wanted to tell you guys that this organization method is working great. It still looks good and it's super functional. So I went ahead and did the same thing over on the side of the laundry room so you can see how much organized it looks now. And you'll see those two baskets on the back of the dryer there and that's where I keep the kids clothes after it's gone through the dryer and this kind of forces them to rotate their outfits. Just a little mom tip right there. Alrighty guys, thank you guys so much for joining me in today's clean and organization of my refrigerator. I hope it gave you guys tons of inspiration to get your fridge cleaned and organized for a busy week ahead. If you guys like this type of video, don't forget to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new and I will see you guys in next week's video. Bye guys!